Shalom, all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Kakodash, which in the Hebrew means uh, all praise to the Most High, true name is Yahweh, by Hashem means in the name. Yahweh Shai is the true name of whom the world ignorantly and stubbornly calls Jesus, and uh, Raka Kodash uh, translates indirectly to Holy Spirit. All right, Raka means spirit, Kodash means holy. Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone, who rule well through the scriptures, peace to the hopeful elect. This is Psalms 50, Psalms 50, starting at verse 16. It says, But unto the wicked the Most has said, What hast thou to do to declare my statutes? Or that thou shouldest take my covenant in thy mouth. Right, so if you're a wicked person, then you ain't got no business saying or speaking about what the Bible mean. All right? And the Bible determines what's wicked and what's good, what's wrong and what's right. All right. So if you're not following it, then you don't have any business to, to, to say what it means to speak on it. Verse uh, 17. Seeing thou hatest instruction and castest my words behind thee. Right. And uh, uh, many examples of uh, IUIC, Israelites United in Christ, going off according to the Bible. All right. Now, when you read... Uh, What's that? When you read, uh, I think it's Proverbs. All right, one second. I'm going to jump to Proverbs. Proverbs speaks about instruction being the way of life. All right. Let me see. Let me see if I can get that. Proverbs 5. Mm. Let me see. So like you one second. Let me uh search for this scripture. Way life. All right, uh, Proverbs six and twenty three. It says, For the commandment is a lamp, and the law is light, and reproofs of instruction are the way of life. Reproof uh, in the Hebrew, thawak, thawaka, chaf, thawaka, chaf. All right. It says rebuke, correction, reproof, punishment, chastisement. So when you when when you see um when you get corrected according to the scriptures, that's the way of life. All right. The when you read uh, the book of Timothy, it says uh. Uh, all the, is is profitable for doctrine. Let me see. Let me get that profitable. So like your doctrine, and that's basically it. Sounds like a a reiteration of the Old Testament. All right, Second Timothy three and sixteen. It says all Scripture is given by inspiration of the Most High, and is profitable for doctrine. For reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness. I'm going to read 17. That the man of the Most High may be perfect, truly furnished unto all good works. All right? So back in um, Psalm 50, in verse 17, seeing thou hadest instruction and castest my words behind thee. Yeah, the scripture says, uh, make mention of the name of the Lord. And the, 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 uh, the Most High's name is Yahweh, and his son's name is Yahweh Shai. The, the, the leadership in IUIC spoke contrary to that. All right. It says, uh, when thou sawest a thief, then thou consentest with him and has been partaker with the adulterers. Right. Who's the ultimate thief? The so-called white man. All right. Uh, uh, that particular group got a 501 scene three. The scripture tells you make no uh, agreement, make no covenant with the heathen. All right. Now, you, you may have people say, well, you got a license or you got a birth certificate or you, well, that's out of your control, all right? There's certain things that, that uh, you, you must do in society to, to get by that you really don't have no control over. The scripture says, be not uh, over much righteous and be not over much wicked, all right? So it's a, it's a balance to that. Things you, things you got control over, all right, you, you operate accordingly. And things that you do not have control over whatsoever, then, for example, the scripture says a homosexual is supposed to be put to death. We ain't out here putting homosexuals to death. All right? 
It says, Thou givest thy mouth to evil, and thy tongue frameth deceit. Yeah, they tongue frame deceit. All right? Uh, uh, calling calling uh, uh, our, uh, the leaders and elders and the men of Great Millstone rapists. All right? Rape little girls. All right? To, 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 um, to, uh, Steer, uh, steer potential followers away from us. Well, that don't even matter anyway, because uh, the Lord, uh, the scripture says, none of the elect can be plucked out of the Lord's hands, roughly paraphrasing. So that don't matter. But nevertheless, they tongue frame deceit. All right. Says thou sittest and speakest against thy brother, thou slanderest thine own mother's son. Right. It says these things hast thou done. And I kept silence. See, see the, see the Lord was quiet, you know, for a second. It says, thou thoughtest that I was altogether such and one as thyself. It says, but I will reprove thee and set them in order before thine eyes. And that's what's happening. All right. Uh, the, the different skirmishes that's coming to, like currently they got a, 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 a woman is missing, uh, uh, possibly dead or killed. Well, we don't know, but for the time being, she missing. I believe her name is Joy Morgan. And they, uh, if I'm if I'm if I'm correct, another IUIC male member is a suspect. All right. So you got a uh, you got other certain members of IUIC have defected. All right. You had one woman a year or so ago talking about how she, uh, she defected and tried to leave, and they were stalking her. Not too long ago, uh, 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 a guy, uh, Bezalel, he was uh, Bezalel and another guy they called the Pocket. They defected. All right, over over money issues, they was they was uh the leadership IRC was scamming money, scamming money from these people. All right, so it's been a while since the Lord uh this this, this the Lord said what a long time have I refrained myself touching their wick. Matter of fact, let me get this real quick. This is a uh, second as just kind of second as just fifteen. <laughs> I'll read it off my Bible because it's, it's not coming up. Uh, this is a uh, second Ezra 15 and 8. It says, I will hold my tongue no more as touching their wickedness, which they profanely commit. Neither will I suffer them in those things in which they wickedly exercise themselves. Behold, the innocent and righteous blood cried unto me and the souls of the just complain continually. All right. So this says. Verse 22, now consider this, ye that forget the Most High, lest I tear you in pieces, and there be none to deliver. Whoso offereth praise glorified me, and to him that ordered his conversation aright, will I show the salvation of the Most High. And I'm, I'm pretty sure that word conversation goes into conduct. So let me, get, let me look that up real quick. Psalms 50 and 23. Conversation. The rock in Hebrew way, road, distance, journey, manner, a uh, roadway, path. So you got to direct your path. All right. A right. Now, what did King David say? Uh, he said, order my steps in thy word. Your steps, what? Your path. So make sure you're going on the right path. All right. So I'll read that part again. Uh, Psalm 15, 22. Now, consider this. Ye that forget the most high. See, they, uh, a lot of members have forgotten the Lord in that. All right, it's basically a, a Christian church with an Israelite spin because you get caught up in the traditions, you get caught up in the in the um in the in the um in the celebrating the high holy days, you get caught up in the looking nice with the garments, you get caught up with the dancing and all of that. All right, it says, "Lest I tear you in pieces, that there be none to deliver." So the Lord basically telling you to repent. All right. Consider, Isaiah 1 and 3 said, my people do have not consider, man. All right, so it says, whoso offer praise glorified me, glorified the Lord. And to him that order his conversation aright, order his steps aright, his path, will I show the salvation of the Most High. So you, you, you got to get right and you're going to be saved. All right, so I'm going to jump to back to that picture. And I got this picture on here to represent, this is a church, all right, that's destroyed. And we know the scripture speaks about uh. The spirit of the Lord dwelling not in buildings made by hands. You know, that's an Acts 7 and that's an Acts 17. But it's symbolic because the church is supposed to represent a body of believers. All right. And that particular church, IUIC, 
the Lord is dismantling it, all right? Because because it's not of him. And how do you know it's not of him? Because it's it's not according to the to the scriptures. First of all, first of all, you got rid of the name. When they said you can uh you can call the Lord Yo Plate Yoga, that the scripture doesn't the scripture doesn't say that. The scripture says, make not mention, make no mention of other guys. Alright? <laughs> but I'm gonna get this real quick. Uh Real quick on that note. Hold on, spell it wrong. It says, this is Second Timothy 2019. Nevertheless, the foundation of the most high stand is sure. Having this seal, Yahweh knoweth them that are his. So the Lord know who he is. All right. Them, uh, and let everyone that nameth the name of Mashiach, nameth the name, all right, his name is Yahawashai. Let everyone that nameth the name of Yahawashai depart from iniquity. All right, so you got to depart from iniquity. You can't put it in your back pocket to when you need it later, all right? Like, ooh, this will go good with a little bit of iniquity, okay? So let me jump to uh, Matthew 16 and 18. <laughs> This is Matthew 16 and 18. And I say also unto thee that thou art Peter, and upon this rock I will build my church, and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. All right? And uh, these different churches, and I'm, I'm speaking about IUIC, but it's not just them alone. These different bodies of, uh, of uh, blasphemers, whether it be the heathen or whether it be other Israelite groups or uh, churches or whatever that don't believe in the true word, true word of the Lord, according to the Bible, they're they're rep they're in representation of the gates of hell. All right, because any way that's not uh, of of this way, which is according to the way the Lord wanted, is going to lead you to hell. All right, and they're not prevailing against it. They tried their best to uh to 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 destroy this what's going on. And it wasn't scriptural. Oh, they're rapists. They raping babies. The, the, uh, uh, they're raping little girls. False accusations. No gym. No no great millstone member has has been arrested on such an on, on any type of account. They're bums. All right. Uh, the majority and we're taught and uh, encouraged to have jobs, which many have jobs. All right. Take care of themselves, etc. I mean, things happen where you uh, you lean on the body for, uh, here and there, but that's 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 just. That happens in the world. Well, it used to when people didn't hate each other as much, but uh, they, they don't take care of their their their, their children. They're deadbeats. More unfounded uh, uh, false accusations. Many 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 uh, members of Great Millstone. Many men take care of their children uh, financially, whether it be uh, child support, which is wicked, and more so having them in their own custody. All right. So you're trying to prevail against the truth with those false accusations, false slanders, and it's and it's not happening. All right, what 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 is happening? This what's happening. Get this real quick. A uh, Psalm 7:16. His mischief shall return upon his own head, and his violent dealings shall come upon his own pate. So everything you're doing is, is coming back unto you. Uh, Isaiah. 28 and 15. Is that 28 and 15? Yeah. <laughs> he says, uh, because you ye, because ye have said, we have made a covenant with death, and the so-called white man is 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 death. All right, just look at him. All right. Anything he look, the rainforest is dying. All right, the, the animals don't have uh, their proper habitats, and so now they're coming into the cities. And they, they got to get rounded up so uh, and killed or, or poisoned. or So they're dying. All right. The, the water is poisoned. You got fluoride. You got uh, oil spills. You got plastic in the ocean. That's dying. The air. All right. The scripture says he is as death and as hell. All right. But you made a covenant with him. All right. It says. And and with hell are we at agreement. When the overflowing scourge shall pass through, it shall not come unto us. Right. The scripture says, for the devil have a little time. He's coming down upon thee with great wrath. All right. The enemy coming in as a flood. 
that's that overflowing scourge when he when he when he gonna finally let loose and and, and just uh, execute his hatred upon our people, the Israelite people, which are the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. We gonna finally do that without impunity, man. He ain't gonna be making excuses like how the police shoot us down now and say, oh, I, he was reaching, uh, he was reaching for something. Uh, he not gonna do that. He just gonna, he just gonna come down. I mean, you not, and, and, and that's and that's another thing. Uh, uh, that particular group wasn't teaching that. They wasn't teaching Jacob's trouble. And the scripture says in Jeremiah 37, there shall be a day, a day like no other, even the time of Jacob's trouble, but he shall be saved out of it. You're not preparing the people for that. All right. Why? Because at hell are you with agreement. He said, it shall not come unto us, for we have made lies our refuge, and under falsehood have we hid ourselves. Mm. So this is, uh, I'll end it with this here. Psalms 127 and verse 1. It says, A song of degrees for Solomon. Except Yahweh build the house, they labor in vain that build it. Except Yahweh keep the city, the watchman waketh but in vain. So, with that, Lord willing, this was an edifying lesson to the hopeful elect. Once again, all praises to Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bashim Kakudash. Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone who rule well through the scriptures. Honorable mention to the brothers out there prophesying the truth and sincerity in hopes of being saved. Shalom.